Hi, Laura and Preston. You've been on several shows recently. Tell us about some of the pet wisdom you've been sharing. It was really a lot of fun. We talked about, you know, how you kind of need to just ask yourself what kind of dog is going to best suit my lifestyle. And I'm a huge proponent of bringing an animal into your life and all of the joy and happiness that, you know, pets whether they're a dog or a cat, bring to you. But at the same time, you have to think, are you financially prepared? Are you in, in the, the right position to provide an adequate amount of love, training, exercise, socialization? So you really have to think about where you are now and where you might be 10, 15 years and, and be committed to being there for the life of the animal. What have been some of the biggest changes you've been seeing in the pet industry? Um, so I've really seen the evolution from I guess people being just pet owners to pet parents, we're not looking at our pets as property, and as such, that's being reflected in the choices that we're making for pet products, for nutrition. And this is the love of my life. Preston has given me infinite love and loyalty for the last 10 years. So everything that I put into his body and everything I allow him to play with, I have to know that it is, is the highest quality and the safest thing that I can give to him, and I think that that's how you know, all pet owners are starting to look at their dogs. This is a business that revolves around a four-legged member of people's family. So um, it's just a lot more meaningful. You've been active with a lot of animal charities. It's one of the cool things where we work with um, local charities in Los Angeles, like Noah's Bark, Compassion for Canines, Hounds of Hope, who are just tiny charities where everyone's a volunteer, no one's making any money. People are spending their last dollar saving every animal that comes into their path. You're also starting one yourself. Preston just turned 10, so in celebration of Preston's 10th birthday, we're launching the Preston's Planet Foundation. The first program that I want to launch is called the Potastics, and it's an animal-assisted therapy program. It's a little bit of a different spin on traditional therapy work, and that's something that we've been personally involved with for almost 10 years. I love this dog. We've gone everywhere and done everything together, and you know, he's, he's just my best friend. Laura, you're also a dog trainer. Tell us about your philosophy. I really think every dog has the capacity to learn and understand and communicate. People just have to put the time in. You have to make training a regular part of your life. And I'm a, a big fan of you know just encouraging people to spend more time with their dogs. One of the biggest trends we're seeing in the pet industry is better nutrition for our pets. What are your thoughts? Why aren't we doing this from the beginning? Why can't we feed our dogs the best possible food from the time when they're a puppy all the way through their older years. Dogs just have so much of a better chance of living a long, happy, healthy life if we're putting good food into their bodies. Give your dogs the best food that you can afford. How can our viewers follow what you and Preston are up to? Preston and I are very active online. We're total internet geeks. So you can find us on Facebook, at Laura Nativo, or at Preston Casanova. On Twitter, same thing. Are you smiling? Yes. Where's happy. your tongue? Let me see. Show me your teeth. <laughs> Sorry, he just farted. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I'm like, I'm like suffocating right here.